Lindsay Cabarrus County Schools released a statement just a short while ago calling the board members' comments, quote, unacceptable and inappropriate. The board chairperson says the board members' comments are now under review. Cabarrus County School Board member Laura Blackwell first called a fellow board member a derogatory name during recess of a virtual board meeting Monday night. I'm telling Barry Shoemaker. Then, four minutes later, she used the R word, which disparages people with special needs, to refer to the process of making decisions about schools reopening during the COVID 19 pandemic. I don't give him the benefit of crap. This is the most thing I've ever seen. We have done so much detriment to these kids. Later during the meeting, Blackwell apologized. We were in a recess, and I, I certainly, um, you know, I can't. Um, I can't say anything, but I'm sorry um, and just was frustrated and again, didn't realize that my mic was live, so I apologize. Melanie Miller is the executive director of the ARC of Union and Cabarrus, a group which helps children and adults with intellectual and developmental disabilities. To our community, the, this, the, this is a slur. This is a word that's been used to mock and ridicule our community. and. Just again, um, to just to see that kind of pop up, what was hard to hear. School board chairperson Rob Walter released the following statement, which says in part, quote, I was disappointed that the incident happened and that emotions got heated to where a board member would use hurtful language to express frustrations even outside of the meeting. This is not typical behavior and has upset a number of people listening to our meeting. Ms. Blackwell appeared remorseful, did apologize for her actions during the meeting. We will review the incident and our board policies if for Further action is required or necessary, the board will do so at our next meeting. Now the next Cabarrus County School Board meeting is October 5th. It's a work session. I called and emailed Blackwell today, but I did not get a response from her. Now coming up tonight at 6, I'll tell you more about what Cabarrus County Schools Code of Conduct says about the conduct of school board members. I'm live tonight at the Cabarrus County School Board. Robin Kennedy, Fox 46, getting results.